Honourable Members, the uncertainty surrounding the Houghton Improvement uh, Project continues to have a major negative implication for road construction in the country. We need to move on from the debates to, of, of previous years and find solution to this challenge. To resolve this funding impasse, the government, uh, the Houghton Provisional Government has agreed to contribute 30 percent to settling Sundral's debt and interest obligations, while national government covers 70 percent of this. Government will also, Houghton will also cover the cost of maintaining 201 kilometers and, as, and associated joint. <laughs> Will the 201 kilometers and associated interchanges of the roads and any additional investment uh, in road will be funded through their existing electronic toll infrastructure or new toll plaza or any other revenue source with the, their area within their area of responsibility? Let me just explain this because it became okay. Before that, let me do this. Government proposes to make an initial allocation of 23.7 billion from the national fiscus, which will be dispersed on strict conditions. Let me that then explain, because there was something which, when I addressed the media, let me explain this thing. For seven years, we've been battling with it all in heart. And for all the political wrangling, it has had an impact on the balance sheet of Sandra. What is the implication now Sandal is due to, is can default any time. So we've agreed with Howden. Howden, take your toll, your roads. We will take the debt, a better portion of it, but you will contribute 30% of it. From then, Tina is national Moving forward, if you decide to, sell, to maintain the roads, you as Houghton, you can either toll to get the, it, the, the maintenance or you can, for your own revenue, do something about that. So, save value it all from today in that sense.